There she is. The boost. Hey, what's up guys? Today we are starting our solar installation. Uh, kind of just taking a lot of measurements and making sure we have all the right stuff. Essentially just making a list. We've got our buddy here, Tim, who's helping us put in our, in, helping us install our solar. That's right. Big help. Shout out to him. Tim is Chuck's brother. Yes. Chuck is the one who welded our roof rack and our wood stove. Hey guys! Couldn't do it without the Whitworths. Yeah, the Whitworths clan is strong in California. <laughs> you guys gotta have like your line, your like your tag. Like, when you're... Greetings, friends, or like, hey there, followers. Like the one you say every time your intro. Hey YouTube. No. We haven't done a lot of like intro intros, but yeah. Tomorrow Tim's gonna come back, and we're gonna actually start putting things in place uh he's gonna go home and measure some stuff out mount all the components to a board that we're gonna mount inside the bus and then we're gonna start wiring it up and then we still have to buy our batteries and a few other things batteries are really expensive deep cycle batteries are crazy expensive Get those two there. we're still kind of feeling it out where we're gonna put everything So what do you have for scrap plywood? Like that piece? Mm -hmm. The piece was 43 and a half. Tim is an electrician, although he is residential, not vehicular. Uh, we'll see. He, I'm pretty confident in his skills. Sometimes he second guesses himself, but I think he'll be just fine. We're going to put all of our stuff right here, the charge controller and the inverter, um, and the batteries, still kind of undecided about where they're going to be, but most likely down here somewhere, maybe under here, kind of want to put them underneath the bus. Again, still feeling it out. Panel's going to be somewhere up on the roof, not exactly sure yet. It's like the story of my life. Not quite sure yet. I'll know when I get there. Yeah. My other one was like pushing 200. Normally there's a 12 gauge and an AR-15 up against the rack. Some children. Because this is where Tim throws the local neighborhood tweakers. <laughs> Locks them in the cage. So today we are 
trying to figure out this rat's nest. <laughs> Tim here is an electrical engineer and a self-proclaimed astronaut. <laughs> um, and he's going to do all of this, help tidy it up at least, but we're going to move it back here because this right here is all going to be like the cat area. It's going to be like insulated and then carpeted and then we're going to like wall it off. That way the cat's going to have like a little hideaway space. And then Tim's running some conduit so we can run all the wires through. Nice. Looks a lot better. Alright, we're gonna cut some metal. Be a hero. You have a pair of gloves in place sparks fly? Uh yeah. going to have to move uh, connect anything to this already existing panel but uh, we're gonna take this whole panel this is one uh, one piece we unscrewed it from this bracket which is welded I'm gonna cut that off this thing comes up a little bit and uh, I think we're gonna I'm gonna screw it to this piece of wood up high to get it m as much out of the way as we can for as much space up here as we can and then we'll uh, work on that cat area later, but... Or I could just finish the panels. That's great. We also realized we didn't have to do anything else in there with electrical, so... My buddy Tim's really been a good help. For the short time that he's here, he fucking kills it. Alright, so this is another one of those videos where I tell you about all the things that we did wrong making the video. First thing, we started the solar project thinking that we would get everything mounted that day. When I had Tim come over to help us, we realized that we still needed some parts, like the battery cable, um, some fuses, some master switches, like some high rated master cutoff switches. So, he had to go order those parts. Now we have some time in leeway. Once the parts get here, we're going to finish up installing all the solar. We're going to put the solar panels just on this panel, on this side of the rack. However, for the time being, we're going to wrap up the roof. Also, wall in more pieces. So, I thought we were just going to be like, oh, here's the solar day, we're going to get it all done, we didn't get it all done. We're going to finish installing the ceiling. Now that we have the wires in the conduit out of the way, now we can start framing our shower and the closet and fit everything in. It's all coming along pretty swell. So now I'm headed to Home Depot to get some more stuff. I need some more insulation, foam, the panel kind. I need more of that thin panel plywood that we've been using for everything. We'll see how that goes. It's like my go-to phrase. We'll see how it goes. Huh? So we're currently working on getting these back panels insulated and covered so we can finalize the wall. We have also started this wall. You can see there's a little insulation there. We're gonna finish this up. 
just went and bought this thinner insulation so that it could fit to this bar because the thick stuff we've been using up here has to clear this or at least fill in as much space as we wanted so we had like inch and a half this is only an inch thick so we got inch thick insulation and now we can put a wall over it like that all your 12 volt stuff is going to run off of and then we've got this bus bar which is the black wire the power wire for the where the um the 12 volt stuff goes there and then the white ones attached to here and you just screw them in and then a white wire will come from and that charge. and the charge control there's that picture there's one more kill switch and so much yeah, it's a, it's a process. Oh my god. This one goes here. It's a kill switch for what? Um, you want kill switches in between your batteries and your controllers and stuff. Okay. But, basically, your batteries are going to be down here, mm -hmm. and your solar is going to be up there, and the solar will come down, the other fuse that showed up, comes down through a fuse into here, and then uh, it goes down this through this switch, through this fuse, to your batteries, and it charges your batteries. And then power also comes up those same wires back to your controller and jumps into your fuse box and your neutral bar here. And from here they just go off to wherever we're going to put um, your little uh, cigarette ports and 12 volt fan. And, and the batteries get wired to this as well. And then there'll be um, two cables coming off of here that go through this switch and fuse down to the battery. Cool. And then uh, this is the 30 amp fuse that uh, the, um, the solar goes through before it goes into your charger. If there's some sort of malfunction with your your wire that comes from your solar will go into or you can just slice this and splice it in but the wire goes through this and into here and so that if there was a malfunction with your solar panels it wouldn't fuck up your expensive controller. <sighs> I'm strategically breaking the panel and it's still kind of long. not bad. The rest of it looks really good. I like the way it looks when all the silver is like on the same side. <laughs> looks like a space space fan. Yep. I think that's about it with the insulation. Mm -hmm. Except for just this little piece right here, but I don't know what we're going to do with that. And I'm not going to insulate this because this thing's probably going to get hot. So I'm going to leave that bare. Hey everybody, we are working on finishing our ceiling here. Finally, we're getting it done. We've got all the electric put up. We have this wall exposed. It's like fitting every piece is challenging, getting it to bend. The walls are round, so but it's annoying and tedious. It's 
been challenging, but we're getting it done. All right, so this is how it turned out. Pretty rudimentary, but it holds it up. It gives us all this space right here. Still working on the ceiling. We don't have much done. We've got this guy. This back piece. And all of the sides. 